welcome to my channel it's early morning here so um you have what you have um i've got a quick unboxing which i'm going to be recording editing and getting straight up onto the channel which of course if you're watching this then you're already there so there's a little bit of a sticky thing on my box this is scaredy cats this is the season that is coming so fall and halloween and all that kind of stuff Scaredy Cats is still available on the site. If you are, hang on. If you are a brand new customer to Diamond Art Club, you can use my affiliate code and get a 15% discount. Details are down in the description. Um, but this has a bit of a glitch. Ooh, interesting. This stamp here is up here embossed so it's it's normally up here <laughs> interesting that it shifted or something shifted no that's in the right place something the embossing went into the wrong place very weird because there's a line that blue line also shows that um it's a square <laughs> and it's like a double print okay i got a glitchy box cool scaredy cats though it's so cute i saw this um, on the website last year and it was like oh yeah 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 I'll get all my Halloweens together now so get the stuff out of the box and it, this is heavy took it and everything is out of the box always check the box there are some instructions on the back of the box as to how you diamond paint if you're not used to these boxes um, and then you get the other instructions as well, of course. Now, this is by Jeff Haney. The stats are, it's 71 by 56. It's pretty big. Um, so you may get this done. If you were to buy this right now, you may get this done by Halloween. You have about six weeks to do it. Uh, you're talking about 80 plus hours. Of diamond painting and it's square so you're going to be going a bit slower than round now the only reason I'm doing this is to get it flat I actually store these flat in a folder so they will flatten over time but that is the way to get them instantly flat just like you would with the double-sided tape versions so there is scaredy cats aren't they cute now some people have changed the colors of the eyes they do look green in the picture but I think we'll find that when we get to the drills they're yellow so we'll take a look at that in a minute but you've got the um, pumpkin as well there are 46 colors there is a glow in the dark and there is one AB I think the box actually gives you those details too it does say how many ABs the details are certainly on the website um, I just went on and checked and they are still there and they're gorgeous these are the little bonus stickers if you haven't already seen them. So these can go, they do fit on the end of the boxes. So if um, storing them on their boxes is what you'd like to do and you want to be able to see what's in your catalogue by just looking end on because that's how you view your boxes. Um, that's where you can put the sticker or you can put it in an album or wherever the heck you like. It's cute as square um, kit. Square Kit has a bonus being that it's got the tweezers. These tweezers are excellent. These are the ESD 14s. Uh, if you ever need to buy spares, um, they've got a little stamp on them. If you buy them off something like AliExpress, there each one has a different number um, and they have a different point then as a result. So the ESD 14s are the straight, pointy, dangerous black ones. There is a four placer head. I'm not opening the tray. Um, if you want to see what's in the tray, check out any other video that you might see from Diamond Art Club, but a lot of us are not opening these kits anymore. Or go to the beginning of the year, my very first video of the year, um, unboxing a square and a round, I show the kits. There's two wax pads in the shape of the hearts, blue pen, there should be a blue squishy, there it is, um, some bags and the drill tray. The drill tray has short lines, I hate them as a result of that, that's just me. Um, I want maximum space and hence I actually use a much much bigger tray than I get from the kids. Um, some schools are taking them, some people will break them down, some pe other people will sell them. Um, do whatever you need to do with your kids. 
All right. Now, if you watch Mrs. Coffee or even Becky, Becky's Madness for no, she might be Becky's Crafting now. She was Becky's Madness for Crafting. Anyway, Becky doesn't like these, and Mrs. Coffee is collecting them to give them to her for Christmas. So if you have any of these in the states, send them to Mrs. Coffee. Her address is in her description on her YouTube channel. Alrighty, um, let's get into the drills first and we'll look at this. What I will do though is roll this inside out. Now, you don't need to do this. You could, as a purchaser, you could just throw this onto the floor and give it 10 minutes and it will be flat as a tack. It's only because I'm on the channel and I need it to unravel a little bit faster that I'm getting into it. All right, noise. Oh my goodness, it sounds like Christmas. It's been so long since I've done an unboxing. <laughs> it's the little things. And my mic pickup was probably fantastic. So it was all kinds of noisy for you if I left the noise full. Okay, there is a lot of drills here. 46 colors. Um, alrighty, let's grab an end. A flat end. And we'll go through these. Okay. All right, so it's square. Now hopefully this will show. Oh, look at that with the sunlight. The ABs are going to glow. All right, 814 is a dark red. One, two, three of those. So they will be in the fall leaves and in the, in the pumpkin too. 550, my favorite purple. How gorgeous is that? Now I can see there seems to be a little bit of not quite flat bottoms there, but they will be okay. I think it's just the edging. One five five, two of those in the lilac. Four ninety eight, two of those. So many colors. Cherry red, which or uh, kind of more like a brick red. Four hundred. One, two, three of the four hundreds in brown. I'm liking the sunlight, although it's pretty harsh. 3371, which is the dark brown, and there are three of those. 939, only the one navy. Black, 310, two of those. If you ever need a break from a Mandy Manzano. <laughs> uh, and 333 is a purple. That looks a little bit that looks better it's probably a little bit more purple than blue like the camera showed there now let me think I want to... I actually transfer these into a different kind of bag for storage, long-term storage, hence me doing the folding. So 333, there was one there at the end and there's another one here, so there's two of those. 327, there was one of those, purple. Lots of purple in this. I'm, I mean, I know there's a purple background, but I'm still quite surprised at how much purple there is. Uh, 210, which is a pale pink. Hang on, no, that sun is, there's a bit better. Sun is a little bit glary now because the clouds have come out. Uh, 301, which is an orange brown. 3746 is two of those in lilac. It's a dark lilac. 947. Right. 947 is an orange. Ooh, sorry. Come on. That's a little bit better. 666. Red, cherry, a uh, Christmas red, even. 898, which is a brown. There is the glow in the dark. Okay. So E742, it's orange in daylight. 
It's the same color as 742. And this one glows in the dark. Okay, now I don't know if I can get this in the dark because it's now charged by the sun. I don't know. I normally take them downstairs where it is pitch dark. Now, let's see if we can get the bling happening on these. Now, look at the shine. If I can. Okay. Get it there. It's better. So, 132 is your AB. So it's got the um, dark orange and it's got a kind of silver topping on it. 780 is a brown. 211 is a very pale pink lilac. There we go. Ooh. There. 3776 is a kind of orangey brown. 938 is a dark brown. Did we have a 938 before? 818 is a pale pink. Oop, glare. It's a very light pink. Oh, that's fun. There we go. It's kind of like a petal color. 150 is a red. 955 is another brownie red. And 3830 is a kind of pinky color. I don't know all of the names of the in my head of the, like the proper DMC name. Okay, the last and the token colors. 606 is an orangey red. It's, it's a funny kind of, it's close to 666, but it's not quite. Uh, 823, which is a navy. Kind of like the 939 cousin. Uh, 373 is a pink. 321 is a brick red. Don't mind the toddler. Uh, 3826 is a brown, tan. 740 is an orange. It's a rich orange. 209 is lilac. 728 is a um, bright orangey yellow. 961 is a pink. 600 is a darker pink. 3350 is another pink. 3733 is another pink. Where are all these pinks? Goodness. 3865, there are some token creamy whites. 797, some bluey purples. 779, some browns. 783, some oranges. 336, a couple of navies. You kind of wonder why. 208, some dark lilac three uh, sorry seven eight two which is a kind of orange still orange and 307 is a bright yellow right let me flip these and I'll show you the color palette um, if you do want to replace your colors of your eyes because there's no green here there's color palette but if you want to replace the eyes um, Tina from DP Spark with sparklers um, she sells them locally uh, got drills USA I think is the other group that you can get them in um, hold please Um, so if you need to get a different color to put in them, um, jellies would work maybe, or some crystals even to put some sparkly eyes. Mm. Okay, this is wide. <laughs> I'm not sure where I'm going to put this. Everything's going to come crashing down if I move it too far. Oh, the joys of a small workspace. Okay. Let me show you this entirely. Uh, sorry, I'm trying to shift the camera that way. Uh, yep, that's kind of it. There they are. I know it's only little, but I'll show you in more detail. Now, okay. Goodness. All right. 
So with the canvas, you've got the inventory on both sides, so you can check your references where they are here. Look. Up here on the left and down on the bottom right. Uh, so E is 783. So these are the oranges. Um, so 783, 782, and your 780 are your three eye shades. Um, if you've got your own cats, you might want to mimic their eye color, especially if you've got blacks. My black had green eyes, and one of them, no, no, both of my blacks had green eyes. So I would probably look at changing it to green. Okay, but where are the important colors? ABs. Um, ABs are in the edge of the Halloween pumpkin eyes, the nose. Hang on, I'm off camera. Okay. So here along the edge, there's some into the center here. There's a big area here, but right along the edge, there's not an awful lot of ABs in this. <coughs> it's just the token colors. So some on the edges here of the teeth. <coughs> and there is a sparkly leaf down here. And then there's a couple thrown in as well. Now, if you want to throw in more, if you've got leftovers, swap them out and throw them in if you like um because this is just leaf litter down the bottom so it doesn't really matter you don't have to be too particular now the magic color of the glow in the dark is the dot so the dot is only in the mouth the nose and the eyes so they are going to be the bits that glow in the dark. Now, you may be able to find people who finished this from last year to see the difference of the um, normal picture and then what glows. Um, if you look on probably Instagram, I don't know how you're going to search. Oh, if you search scaredy cats, people may have hashtagged um, them, but you're talking about a year, or, a year ago. And... Um, yeah, they may or may not um, have got them finished a year ago. Right, colour blocking is not in great demand in this. Um, there's some colour blocking up the top here in the moon. There's some colour blocking here in behind the trees and here. But all of these, these are stripes. And you can see how stripy they are. There's fairly long lines. If you like multi-placing, you could get away with that. And to be honest, it's not really confetti heavy. Um, this would be um, a happy medium of colour blocking. And um, I mean, it's not big blocks, but it's not overly confetti. So there's confetti around here where it gets a bit busier. But to be honest, this is this is OK. Um, at square, I think you could potentially do this you know in reasonably quick time I don't think the confetti would throw you off too much um, and you saw how many of those big bags there were um, so yeah I think um, I think you'd be doing pretty okay if you're a bit scared of squ squares um, just get your baseline of three or four down and then go from there the leaves are gorgeous and um, the leaves are really pretty on this too but the pumpkin, those stripes and the textures, it's amazing. Really, really cool. And again, not many, much 310. So you've got 310 here in some of the lines, here around the belly, and of course the kitties are the blacks. But they've also got S, which is, is that going to be 939? Where are you? 939 is the two dots, which are two little dots. So 939 is through here as well. And then the S is 550, so a little bit of purple highlights on the hair. So that's kind of cute. So 939 and black, and then the highlights in purple. Gorgeous. And then, of course, you've got the misty trees in the background. They're gorgeous. They're absolutely gorgeous. That's why I got, got them. Um, I love my black cats. Um, unfortunately, they're all, they're gone. Um, now but um when it comes to coupon codes there are coupon codes on the blue leaflet there are coupon codes on the bottom of the canvas 
Um, there's coupon codes everywhere. Um, they vary in amounts. There can be 10, 15 and 20 percent depending on where you look, what the moon cycle is and everything else. So please don't feel that you need to um, only use one particular code. You can use as many of the, the different codes as you kind of like, but you can only use one at a time. Um, if you use my code, I get an affiliate commission, So, um, but you have to be a new customer for me to get that. It's it, Otherwise, you just get the discount code, and I don't get the commission. So feel free to use it. It just means that P DAC know where the codes are coming from, um, from a customer point of view. And if they see me getting more codes, then, you know, it's kind of like, oh, hey, Pip is selling more. So, yeah. Um, I think that's kind of it. Um, I mean, if you've seen a Diamond Art Club canvas, then you know how good they are. You know that they're fluffy on the background, on the back. Um, you know they've got the surged edges and all of that kind of thing. I'm not trying to teach you to suck eggs. This is, you know, b towards the middle of the year. So um, you've probably seen Diamond Art Club unboxings or even have your own at this stage anyway. But just in case you don't, um, they are exceptional. Um, I haven't had any problems with them. It, any issues I've had, customer service has been onto it like a shot. Um, they really are um, a fantastic company to work with. So um, yes, if you'd like to go check them out, please do. Um, these are available right now and Halloween is coming. So if you would like to, go grab yourself some kitties that don't involve cat litter and maintenance. All right. Um, thank you very much for watching my channel. Um, if you are not already subscribed, please click subscribe um, and ring the bell for a notification when you get um, the videos. Uh, I normally do a whip and chat on a Wednesday. I do floss things on Mondays, Fridays and Saturdays when I upload those videos. Um, and I do these unboxings on Thursdays. So today being my Thursday, I'm going to be finishing this uploading it and getting it onto the interwebs the blonde all right thanks for watching bye for now may the road rise up to meet you may the wind be always at your back may the sun shine warm upon your face and the rain fall soft upon your fields and until we meet again may god hold you in the palm of his hand